Welcome to the desert of the real. you know, with the, you know, 5 percenters, it was a cross between the two. And the thing then was, you know, of course, the three-fourths calls. And I was, when I was younger, I was a tomboy. So, and, and I know you can't believe it, but I'm just saying. I was a tomboy at the time, but now I'm, like, so girly, it's not even funny. <laughs> and the thing is now, I mean, I don't wear three-fourths of cloth, but I don't, I mean, sometimes I do. But it's not all the time, you know, and then, you know, it, and I think sometimes you may feel the need at that certain time. But, I mean, as long as, and I feel like it's all about mindset. If you carry yourself a certain way, you have a certain mindset. As long as, you know, you're not showing all of your assets and your goods, then it's okay. You know, it's okay. This There's is my nothing wrong with being sexy for for a African conscious sister, I'm gonna say that again. I I I, I really must reiterate that. <laughs> yeah, and you know, a lot a lot of sisters are um, not attracted to consciousness or being conscious, quote unquote, because it's just like when, um, let's just say, a sister gets saved or goes into the the Christian doctrine, or, you know, she goes to the church. When they get the and church shoes, when they put them church, the church shoes on. I mean, they feel over. like outside of church, they feel like they can't be fly. And a sister that's in the conscious movement or that's conscious or has knowledge of self, whatever the case may be, she feels that she can't be fly. You can still, still be fly and and have knowledge of self. It, I mean, it doesn't mean that you have to give up your clothing and, you know, rock fabric. You know, that that's 90s. That's That's old. That's so old. You don't have to do that. You know, mm-hmm. but... You know, I will agree that you don't don't become obsessed with labels, you know, or right. the European designer labels, you know. And if you are addicted to designer labels, I would say definitely practice cooperative economics and support your bootlegger. Support your local bootlegger. That's <laughs> if you right. must, if you right. must, you know, rock the European labels. But Lock I would say, Sorry, go ahead. Go on. The so Loch Ness in the chat room says there are a lot of misconceptions when it comes to being African centered. We like to get down too. And Goddess True. Ascension says um, she'd be covered in fly as hell. <laughs> I'm with you, Goddess. Yeah, I'm with you. Same here. Because a, a true style of a person that's a true stylist and has true fashion, you can you can take anything, uh, you can take any piece of clothing and rock it and make it right. Mm-hmm. I mean, that's how I do. So. I can't speak for anybody yeah. else. I noticed that that's what I, I pay attention to when it comes to sisters. Is I like individuality and, you know, when they have their own unique style. You know, I don't like the um, Beyonce pull it off the rack look. I'm just not feeling that. That's like we, we don't need these assembly line chicks. We need some, some, some sisters that got some style and originality. And it doesn't require, like you said, it doesn't require the uh, uh, the traditional, you know, head wraps and this and that, even though that's cool. That's cool. Yeah, it's cool. But, uh, you know, it's cool for sisters to mix it up. And, and like um, Ambassador said, to be fly. Brothers like it when you fly, and they like it when you're original. Real exactly. brothers, I should say. Exactly. Right. You know, if you got a brother that's requesting you to get a perm, you need to leave that dude because he really want a white girl. Exactly. Exactly. Yeah. I kind of had guys wanting me to straighten my hair just to see how long it really is. Ooh. Uh, like, take yeah. for instance, you know, you got to look I, at it like I this. refuse to strain it. <laughs> you got to look at it like this. What if you dated a dude and he always wanted you to dress up like a guy? Wouldn't you say that he's, um... <laughs> yeah, a black boy. <laughs> a chichiman. Yeah. Chichiman. You say, well, why do you want me to dress up like a guy? A why don't you just go get the dude? You know, it's, it's the same thing. If a guy is always requesting you to, to de-Africanize, then tell him go get a white girl. 
<clears throat> no, but he don't want to do that. He wants to he wants to to de Africanize you. That's the turn on the, the, the process. Yeah. Right. Right. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Breaking you down. But now keep yourself. You women is beautiful. You know what I mean. Sisters on there. I see you guys on the Facebook page. You know, um, you know, beautiful sisters, and just the way you are. You know what I mean. And, and if a brother can't accept that, then he he obviously he he's, he's not the one. Something is wrong with him. No, this was like a while ago. I mean, I don't have a problem now. So uh, I had guys that wanted me to straighten my hair just to see what it looked like, but I don't know if they necessarily wanted me to de Africanize myself. You know. Yeah. That, tell that's them, tell them you want them to wear jerry curls to see what he look like. Huh? Tell them you want them to wear jerry curls to see what he look like. Tell them tell them to put on this this um you know <laughs> little g string or whatever. Right. Dude, I okay. Just how, I just want to see how you look like as a Bati boy. Yeah. Oh God. <laughs> you say, look, do you know do you know who I thought was so fine to do from coming to America with the with the for the soul gold prince. I thought he was so fine. You tell him that and and see what happens with the Jerry Curl. Oh boy. <laughs> Eric LaSalle. That was classic. Oh yeah, him. Yeah. But I ain't gonna, I'm not letting y'all off the hook. We no, were gonna talk about sex. Oh. oh. I wanna know I oh. wanna know what what is required or what are the prerequisites before you take it to that level, once you get to the intimate sexual level with the brother. Oh, don't get quiet now. <laughs> <laughs> um, I mean, you want to go first? <laughs> I've been, I was, sis, I was just trying to give you the floor. Oh, man. That's just going out there, huh? Um, okay. Um, for the sex thing, I try to get to know the guy, see if we connect in certain ways. But it's mostly like more of a physical connection. It's no mental relation. So, Mark, you see what type of guys I date. So it's more of a physical yeah. thing. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I'm not. I'm being. I'm being real. So, yeah, keep I mean, it real, sis. Keep I'm real. I'm not necessarily, you know, just give it up to him like that. I do get to know him. We go out, we spend time with each other. Sometimes I just don't even have sex with him at all. I just cut him off, you know. And um, if it's someone I really cared about and I really like and I was really feeling, that's a good chance there. I may be intimate with him, but most chances I really won't. Okay, Ivy. Mm. <laughs> it's my turn. I'm <laughs> <I'm busy>. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just joking. Okay. Um. Well, actually, I, I like to get to know the person because seeing, you know, you 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 have to it, it going to, you know, gay, being sexual is so much more than you know. You have you have to think about a lot of things before you actually, you know, have sex with someone or be intimate shall we say um like i said get to know the person and you know pay attention and i always say pay attention to the signs Mm -hmm. you know because you can tell if you're dealing with a stalker or if you are dealing with someone (laughs) that you should not be dealing with and i think um i think lauren hill broke it down best in um that thing she said um Talking out your neck, saying you're a Christian, a Muslim, sleeping with the jinn. That was to me was powerful because you, sh- if, as a conscious female, you know you should at least, you know, if you can, be, you know, with a brother that's conscious or at least has some form of knowledge of self. You know, it is close to, you know, your level as possible, and that, that's my take on it. <laughs> 